Do a tight fist rotation exercise. Clench your fists tightly and rotate them slowly in a circular motion, first clockwise and then counterclockwise. This exercise improves wrist strength, flexibility, and circulation, helping prevent injuries and improve grip strength. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise. Three, two, one. Do the standing roll forearms against a wall exercise. Stand with your back against a wall, forearms parallel to the floor. Roll your forearms up and down, keeping them in contact with the wall. This exercise targets the forearms, improving grip strength and wrist stability. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise. Three, two, one. Perform standing inner wrist curls. Stand with your arms extended in front of you, palms facing down. Curl your fingers upward as far as possible, then lower them back down. This exercise strengthens the wrist flexors and improves grip strength. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. Perform finger claps. Stand with arms extended to the sides, parallel to the floor. Quickly bring fingertips together in front of the body, then back out to the sides. This exercise improves hand coordination, agility, and strengthens the muscles in the hands, wrists, and forearms. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. Do a side wrist pull stretch. Extend your arm in front with palm facing down. Grab fingers with other hand and gently pull towards body. Hold for 15 to 30 secs. Benefits include improved wrist flexibility, reduced risk of injury, and enhanced grip strength. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. Perform wrist circle exercises. Extend your arms in front of you and rotate your wrists in a circular motion first clockwise and then counterclockwise. This exercise helps improve wrist flexibility, mobility, and strength, reducing the risk of injury and improving performance in various activities. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. Perform the wrist ulnar deviator and flexor stretch. Extend your arm in front with palm facing down. Use the other hand to gently pull the fingers towards you. This stretches the wrist flexors and ulnar deviators, improving flexibility and reducing the risk of wrist injuries. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise. Three, two, one. Perform the wrist extensor stretch. Extend one arm in front with palm facing down, then use the opposite hand to gently bend the wrist downward. Hold for 15 to 30 seconds. This stretch helps improve wrist flexibility and reduce stiffness, beneficial for those who engage in repetitive wrist motions. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. The elbow flexion exercise, such as bicep curls, involves bending your arm at the elbow to lift a weight toward your shoulder. This strengthens the biceps, improves arm strength, and helps with daily activities like lifting. Start with a comfortable weight and gradually increase as you get stronger. Three, 
two, one, rest. Next exercise, three, two, one. Do a wrist deduction exercise. Sit or stand with your arms extended in front of you, palms facing down. Slowly lift your wrists up towards the ceiling, then lower them back down. This strengthens the forearm muscles, improving grip strength and wrist stability. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise. Three, two, one. Do a wrist flexion exercise. Sit or stand with arms extended, palms facing down, and wrists at shoulder level. Slowly curl your fingers toward your body, then return to the starting position. This strengthens the wrist and improves grip strength, essential for daily tasks and sports. Three, two, one, rest. Next exercise. Three, two, one. Perform the reverse wrist curl exercise. Sit or stand with a dumbbell in hand, palm facing down. Slowly curl your wrist up, then lower it back down. This strengthens the forearm extensors, improving grip strength and wrist stability. Three, two, one, rest. 